Well, if you've ever been away from home for an extended period of time, you know how nice it is to get a care package, whether it's maybe some beef jerky or just a letter from mom. Simple pleasures can make the time away that much easier. And those serving abroad in the military certainly know that better than anyone. But what to send and how to send it? Well, that can be a little tricky, which is why our next guest started a company dedicated to making that process hassle-free, a care package that works in a lot of different ways. So uh, let's welcome our guest now. This is uh, Jack Ray. And Jack, tell us a little bit about Hero Care Packages and why you decided to maybe give this process an upgrade. Hey, Joe. Thanks for having me. You know, I saw uh, in, the, in the military firsthand kind of how important care packages were. And, you know, we would be out at sea. I was in the Navy for four years. We'd be out at sea for months at a time. And rather than go out in some foreign port, guys would stand in line for hours waiting for care packages. And, and it, you know, as elated as I was to get them, it broke my heart to see my sailors who didn't receive care packages. Yeah. And I didn't realize how hard it was to send a care package until I got out of the Navy and I started sending care packages to friends and family who were still in the service. Um, and I saw it's really hard. You have to, you know, get all the items, go down to the post office, fill out complicated customs forms. And I was a military veteran and I was struggling with the process. And so I looked for a company that did what Hero Care Packages does that would take the hassle out of the process and it didn't exist. And I said, that's crazy. It needs to exist, so I started Hero Care Packages. So how do you take the hassle out? You pick everything that goes in, right, so people don't have to worry about that, and then you also take care of the shipping as well, right? Sure. We take care of shipping and customs. Uh, you know, the military discount shipping, for example, USPS, if you were to go down there, is $20. Um, and so, you know, we, we can really greatly reduce shipping costs, pass that on to the customer. And the real value is that we're a veteran-run service that's curating high-quality items mm -hmm. for the recipient. Um, you know, less than 1% of people have served in the military. And so for the other 99%, they don't know what to send. And they don't know that, you know, you can't send baby wipes to someone out on a Navy ship because it gets clogged in the ship's plumbing. Or, mm. you know, uh, that you should send smaller things rather than big, large items. Uh, and so we're, we're kind of trying to make sure that, we can help you through that process. And there are a lot of different uh, cost options as well and sizes of these care packages. Talk about some of those options. Sure. I mean, you know, sometimes people can build their own items off of the website. You know, right now we're actually doing a whole revamp on the website and creating a customized build your own package. Um, but we find that people don't really come to us to build their own care package. They, they want our expertise. And so we have packages that uh, range from $40 up to hundreds of dollars which people will often send, we call it the troop package. Uh, it'll go to a, a, you know, a, a, someone that they know that's deployed and they share that, they share those items with uh, their fellow sailors or soldiers who, who didn't receive a care package. I'm wondering what you've heard, Jack, from not only the, uh, the, uh, the military personnel who get these care packages, but the people who send them as well, what it means to both sides. Yeah, you know, uh, so much of the care package process, you know, we try to make it as personalized as possible because that's really what it is. You know, it's it's the letter that you write that matters more than anything. And, and movies don't get a lot right about the military, but one thing they do get right is that when you get that letter from home, you, you know, you read it and reread it over and over, and it's different than getting an email. Um, and so that's really important. And, and, and sometimes we get, you know, responses from people um, and, and that's really what, you know, keeps me going doing this is, you know, people saying I received one of these and it was a, a low point in deployment and it just really made my day. And thank you. You know, yeah. um, it, 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 it warms my heart and, and uh, we, we get those a lot. And the people who send it just love that it's easy um, because it's a very hard process and you wouldn't know that it was hard. You think, oh, you're just sending a box of goodies to someone. Right. Um, it's more complicated than you'd think. Fantastic. Jack Ray, Hero Care Packages. Jack, thanks for your time. Thanks for what you're doing for the troops. Have a great weekend.